the end of YouTube. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing a couple of story times. And I'm going to be drinking some water with ice because I just felt like drinking water. So, this story time was at school. Did you guys hear me yet? School. So I went to school for it. So I was at school and my friends, one of my friends showed me this, um, this tree that, sorry I'm getting distracted because I'm going to put this excess lip balm in here. So don't mind me, I'm just going to put lip balm in here. So... My friend showed me this tree that has berries, has black berries and red berries. So I was really happy that I, she told me that they were berries. So then if I was ever like really hungry, like I didn't eat a lot at lunch, I could just go up there and get some berries. So I was so happy that she told me. And then, um... I got two berries and I gave one to her but she said it was too sour um, I actually liked it but it was also really sour and so she threw it and then what happened was um, the next day my other friend um, said we all actually said hey we should go get some blueberries because it was the first, like, recess, so we were like, yeah, let's totally just go get some blueberries. So, at my school, I'm going to have to put this down because, like, I need to, like, explain some stuff. Actually, I'm, like, practically done with this. It's just the lip balm, just if you're wondering. So... At my school, in the back of the school, where there's a park, um, there's this gate, and then there's this, like, little hill. Not really a hill, but it's just, like, a really high hill. Not really high, but just, it's just a hill that's just made out of dirt, and you can climb up. And then there's a gate, and there's a hill, and then on the other side, there's a hill. Then in the back of those gates are some, is a tree that has all the berries. And then there's the park. And um, the next day, my friend said, we should go get some. And it was after lunch, so we were not as starving, but we just wanted some berries. Because we just wanted beautiful and delicious berries. <laughs> so I went up there. Mind you, I am wearing this Victoria's Secret pink headband that I got and it's the best headband. Since my hair is really frizzy, I've been using it mostly for that. And yes. And keep in mind also, this is basically just fabric. So it can easily get stuck on stuff. And I was wearing a cotton t-shirt. If you're wondering. So I asked my friend to come with me. My other friend was on duty to tell the student to tell me and my friend if someone was coming like a teacher so she was just on guard like in the middle of the area where we're like where the grass area is and like there she's just right there just like telling us if they're gonna come so my friend comes with me and she's just holding one of the things one of the little things that holds blueberries she's just carefully holding it because it has thorns and then um, there's this one that's really tall, which they made me go because I'm the tallest. And then I went up there and I was trying to grab them. And I got two, I think. Yeah, I got two. Then my friend started yelling that someone was coming. So then my other friend just said, hurry up, hurry up. And she let go of the branch. 
it was called Branch. So she like over the branch, and she immediately just ran down the hill because she was too scared. She was gonna get in trouble. So then I go up. No, I don't go up. I just grab the bears really quick. Then I, she made the the thorns get stuck on my cotton T-shirt. So like I'm basically stuck. Then the top part also got stuck. And then I had to take off the bottom part first, and then I took it off. And I thought it was going to go by so easy, so I can just start running with my friends. So she wouldn't care. Like, she wouldn't care if I went up there. But it didn't go how I was planning to. And she was, like, all the way over here. And I was all the way right here. So she was just walking, and I'm just stuck right here. She's just walking and walking and walking walking and then she's at the bottom of the hill and she says come down from there and you're not allowed to be there. So I'm obviously like I don't care. I don't say anything I don't care what they say actually. I don't care what the yard used to tell me like they say I was being bad. I really just don't care. Like I don't care. Like I just don't care. Like why are you even doing this? I don't care. Like I'm not going to care at all. So, and then I, t I went, I ran to my friends because they were at the bark box right next to these like big things. Then I told my friend, why would you guys leave me? And then she's like, well, the yard was coming. I didn't want to get in trouble. And then I told my other friend, well, why did you let go? Why couldn't you just help me like get down and not just let go and run? And she's like, oh, okay. go just leave my life and then I ate both of the berries because my friend asked me to give her a berry but I didn't give it to her because they left me so you guys probably would have done the same thing don't say you don't because if you were actually at the scene you would The final story I'm going to tell you was at, as a tetherball, actually. So, there was this boy. Um, there was, like, three boys that were so mean. And they, I was versus their little, they were all brothers, I think. And one of the, the little, the youngest kids was at the, was there and... I was going to hit because he always beats everyone because his brothers are always telling him like you can do this and this and you can do nothing so I always get nothing they he always gets like ropeys and um, bottle caps slappies seriously everything and oh my lip burns Ew, you can see it it burns So, um, I just start hitting it hard and hard and hard, and then he grabs it and then just hits it, and he's just done, and I'm just so mad at him, but then I beat him, and then his friends get mad at me, but I don't care, because there's you really gonna make me answer that? But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I love you and peace.